Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm excited to announce the launch of a brand new product that is going to revolutionize the fitness market. I formulated this product over the last three years, as you guys know. I've talked about it in a few videos. I've hinted at the fact that I'm working on a formulation. All right, so the formula that I have created for myself requires quite a few products. So every day before I go to the gym, I'm mixing these up. Uh, I have two containers that I take with me. The one I drink before I leave for the gym, and I might finish it on my way to the gym. And the other one I drink during my workout sure to finish this by the time I'm done with the weights. So I'm going to go over this kind of formula real quick. Um, I don't have all the ingredients here. I am out of uh, creatine. I'm out of uh, glutamine and a couple of other things. But this is the bulk of what I take on a daily basis. So first up, I have essential amino acids. This is a blend. It's got virtually all the essential amino acids in it. So I'm going to do two big scoops of this. One big scoop in each of the pre-workout and one in the intro workout. So, see I'm carefully measuring. It's a big heap tablespoon, basically two tablespoons worth of the essential amino acids into each. So, amino acids convert at a ratio of about one to six, depending on which scientific study you want to follow. Um, so, typically speaking, if you were to drink 10 grams of amino acids, that are in the proper ratio, it's equivalent to drinking 60 grams of whey protein as far as how many amino acids your body is getting out of that formula. Next, I throw in a bunch of leucine. Leucine is the primary amino acid responsible for building muscle. So again, I'm gonna do two, two heaping scoops of this. If you total up the amount of the amino acids I've just put into these two containers, it comes out to somewhere around 90 grams of protein worth of amino acids in this formulation. Now to maximize my body's absorption of these amino acids, I'm gonna do a couple of additional things. First up, I'm gonna add some dextrose. Dextrose is a fast acting carbohydrate. It's virtually like sugar and how your body is going to treat it. So I split that up a little in my pre-workout, about half a scoop, and then I usually do about one scoop worth in my intro workout. Now. The reason for this is it's going to spike blood sugar levels, right? So I'm replenishing glycogen within the muscle. It means I can work out longer. Second, with that spike in glycogen, I'm also spiking my insulin levels. So the spike insulin level, insulin is the most anabolic thing that you could have in your system, right? So pro bodybuilders will use actual injectable insulin to increase the number of muscle cells that they actually have. So you have the typical muscle building process that guys think of, which is hypertrophy, where you're expanding the muscle cell. You're increasing the volume of that muscle cell, expanding its size, and that's what gives the bigger muscle look. Now, there's a second type of muscle building, which is probably more important. That is hyperplasia. So what happens then is where your muscle cell actually becomes two muscle cells. You're increasing the number of muscle cells in your system. So instead of just growing, you're multiplying the number of muscle cells. And Utilizing insulin is how pro body builders are able to do that. That's why a lot of them um, have more muscle mass later on in life than a typical bro, uh, gym bro will have, right? So a typical gym bro probably isn't using insulin around their workouts, whereas a lot of pro body builders are. Later on in life, those pro body builders are going to have more muscle cells in their system or on their body than a typical bodybuilder, just gym bro type guy. And therefore, later in life, they're going to have a much easier time maintaining a muscular physique. Okay. Whereas your gym bro, he's just taking, you know, anadrol or whatever. He's getting the muscle volume, but then with time, he loses that muscle size because he doesn't have as many cells to maintain that overall muscle. Now, when I put the dextrose in there, it's going to increase insulin levels, which is going to also increase IGF-1 levels. Okay. So you have increased insulin and increased IGF-1. Both of those are very, very good at causing hyperplasia and driving nutrients into the muscle. So when you have the muscle, it's been damaged from the workout, you want to get it healed as fast as possible. So we're priming the body to get nutrients there as fast as possible with the dextrose. And we're getting the nutrients in the muscle by way of the amino acids. So your body's getting everything it needs to rebuild the muscle as fast as possible, driven into the muscle cells as fast as possible, so your recovery can be as maximized as possible. Next up, I'm going to have some citrulline. So this is a pre-workout that I used to have on Biomuscle. I utilize this in the pre-workout for two reasons. It's got sodium, which helps with pump and cramping. Uh, it's also got it's also got L-citrulline in there, so that's going to help with overall 
blood flow into the muscle throughout the workout. So now you've got increased blood flow, increased IGF-1, and increased insulin, all driving additional nutrients into the muscles. Now, to slow down the spike of insulin and prolong it a little bit, I'm going to add some MCT powder. So just a little bit of that into each. This is getting old and lumpy because I don't use it very fast. And then there are two more products that help quite a bit. Um, first off, I need to mention that I am missing creatine right now. Normally, I'll put creatine into each of these. Um, also, glutamine can be very good for your stomach. It's an amino acid as well. It's very good for the lining of your stomach. So supplementing with glutamine can help your body absorb the nutrients to the max potential, utilize them as much as possible, and help your gut stay healthy. And overall, gut health is going to help quite a bit with your physical health. So I'm missing those two products. Now, another good thing to drink would be a mix of probiotics and prebiotics. You can get something like a yogurt. Uh, and then magnesium and B vitamins are also very good. B vitamins are essential for helping with the absorption of nutrients. Your body needs the B vitamins for energy expenditure and creation, right? And to utilize the nutrients in your system. So by adding a B vitamin complex to this with a couple of other uh, minerals, I'm going to maximize my body's ability to utilize these nutrients and get as much as possible out of them. Then I'm going to go ahead and fill these up with water, mix them up, and there you have it. Now I will say, this tastes pretty bad, right? I don't have any flavor in here. The amino acids like this and the raw powder taste horrible in my opinion. The dextrose is unflavored. Um, the pre-workout is flavored. It's blue raspberry, so that's going to help a little bit in the pre-workout. But this intro workout has no flavoring. It tastes absolutely horrible. Now, I'm pretty excited to announce that I've been working with a company. Total War Horse Fitness has taken me on uh, as a partner in creating this supplement as an actual supplement. So there will be no more of me scooping each of these products out into each shaker cup before my workouts. It's going to save a lot of time. It's going to save a big mess. It's going to save money because I don't have to buy all of these products every single month. Okay. So the, the product from Total War Horse Fitness is going to come in a big two pound tub like this. The product is called Max Build 360. So it's basically this formula that I've just shown you guys myself building coming in a big tub pre made. So one serving is three scoops. Um, it's a big, like I said, big two pound tub of product. And so three scoops will be the total of what I just showed you guys, all these products going into here. It's also going to have a couple of additional ingredients that I didn't put into here, like glutamine, the creatine. It's going to have some additional vitamins and minerals type stuff in there as well. Um, so it's a very, very good pre-workout and intro workout. It's not going to replace a pre-workout for the energy, but it's going to replace the pre-workout nutrients that your body is going to need going into the workout. So of course, you still need to eat a balanced diet, but something like this Max Build 360, this formula that I've created here, is going to work very well to complement your diet and increase muscle recovery. If you look at the bottle, you can see on the label, it says eight supplements in one. It's got the glutamine, A's, BCAAs, creatine, dextrose, which is your carbs, vitamins, prebiotic, probiotic. This is a huge tub. This is a two pound protein jug. It's an absolutely massive bottle of product. You're going to be using three big scoops of this per day. The idea is that you'll take one scoop pre-workout, one scoop during the workout, and one scoop right after finishing your workout. Those three scoops are one serving. So why don't you look at the amounts in this? That is for the three scoops total. So this is formulated for a 180-pound man, approximately. So if you're if you're bigger than that muscle-wise, if you're a 220-pound bodybuilder that's 8% body fat, you're going to want to do like four or five scoops per day. This is available for pre-order starting today, and it should start shipping out at the end of June, possibly beginning of July. Hopefully sooner than that if manufacturing gets done a little bit early and if shipping doesn't go bad. If shipping goes great, that would be fantastic. Hopefully we start shipping this product in the next four weeks. Every day I'll be able to just take my three scoops of that and divide them between my two cups here and drink that. No more mess, no more packages cluttering up the cabinet, right? And so it's going to be phenomenal. I can't wait to share that with you guys. It's going to help you tremendously in muscle recovery, reducing soreness, increasing muscle size, and overall recovering much quicker. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe. I'll see you in the next one soon. Take care.